June 27, Saturday of the 12th week in Ordinary Time, a reading from the Holy Gospel according to St. Matthew. When Jesus entered Capernaum, a centurion approached him and appealed to him, saying, Lord, my servant is lying at home paralyzed, suffering dreadfully. He said to him, I will come and cure him. The centurion said in reply, Lord, I am not worthy to have you enter under my roof. Only say the word, and my servant will be healed. For I too am a man subject to authority, with soldiers subject to me. And I say to one, Go, and he goes, and to another, Come here, and he comes. And to my slave, Do this, and he does it. When Jesus heard this, he was amazed, and said to those following him, Amen, I say to you. Amen, I say to you, in no one in Israel have I found such a faith. I say to you, many will come from the east and the west and will recline with Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob at the banquet in the kingdom of heaven. But the children of the kingdom will be driven out into the outer darkness where there will be wailing and grinding of teeth. And Jesus said to the centurion, You may go as you have believed, let it be done for you, and at that very hour, his servant was healed. Jesus entered the house of Peter and saw his mother-in-law lying in bed with a fever. He touched her hand, and the fever left her, and she rose and waited on him. When it was evening, they brought him many who were possessed by demons, and he drove out the spirits by a word and cured all the sick. To fulfill what had been said by Isaiah the prophet, he took away our infirmities and bore our diseases. The Gospel of the Lord As you have believed, at Capernaum a centurion approaches Jesus and pleads for the healing of his servant. Jesus agrees to come. The centurion, however, asks Jesus to only speak the word for his servant's healing. Jesus commends the centurion for his strong faith. The servant is healed at the same time that the centurion believes in Jesus' word. <music>